Hey, what's up everybody? How you guys doing today? So we're going to root the RCA 7-inch tablet that I picked up. And uh, real quick, I'm going to show you guys that it does have root. A couple of things you guys will need to do uh, to get this done is, one, you're going to have to get your drivers for your tablet. It's real easy. Just connect you know, your tablet with a USB cable to your desktop or laptop computer and uh, it will search for the internet itself and install it. Once you do that, you'll go into developer options and you will check USB debugging. Now, if you don't have developer options open, simply go into settings here and nope, did not want to do that. So let's go into settings. You're going to go to about device and you're going to tap on build number at least like five or seven times until it says that you have opened or unlocked developer options. That will appear in your settings right there at developer options. And then you'll go in there and you'll connect or you'll check USB debugging. So once you do that, we are ready for the next step here, which is getting the program to root the tablet. So here we go. Alright, so from here on your computer is the rest of the work. Um, what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to download Kingo Root, which is a, a program that you can install on Windows. And uh, you're going to go to your browser. You're going to search Kingo Root. And the first link you see, it's going to be www.kingoapp.com. And uh, that's the one you're going to select. And you're going to click that in order to. Um, bring it to the web page to install so um, once it loads up you're gonna go down here to where it says download and you're gonna click that follow the steps to install it to your your laptop and uh, so from there once it's uh, downloaded you're gonna launch the app and um, telling me that uh, there's a high CPU usage on my laptop. But anyways, this is what the app looks like when you launch it. And it's going to tell you that a device is not connected. Um, I'm going to connect uh, one of my other phones here just so you can see what it says. Um, it basically works for 2.3, 4.0.4, uh, and 4.2.2. Anything else like KitKat, it's not going to work for. but. Um, my device is 4.2.2 Jelly Bean, so everything's going to be good. Down at the bottom corner, it's going to tell you if your device is connected or not. So if it's not connected, um, make sure you have it checked in USB debugging. And um, from there, when you do have it connected, then it's going to have the prompt for you to start rooting. And uh, so you'll go ahead and click to root. And once you click to root, just leave it alone and let it do its thing. And um, it shouldn't take no more than two or three minutes for it to cycle through and it's going to tell you step by step exactly what it's doing and uh, in the end your tablet should basically uh, reboot so once it's reboot you'll have super su and you'll basically have full root so anyways um that's pretty much how you root the RCA 7 inch tablet. Um, once you have it root, like full rooted, you could um, debloat it from apps that you don't use and uh, use applications that require root. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, hopefully, that you know explained it very well on how to root the RCA 7 inch tablet that you can get at Walmart for $79.99. And uh, if this video was helpful, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button because it really helps me out. And also subscribe for future content covering this device and the other devices that I have. So um, that's pretty much it, guys. Thank you for watching this tutorial. And uh, you guys have a wonderful weekend.